Thank you, Chaplain, for that invocation. The Civilian Conservation Corps was one of many sweeping policy reforms under President Franklin Delano Roosevelt. In addition to the CCC, FDR enacted legislation to create public housing in America to provide shelter for those families unable to afford a roof over their heads. The Housing Authority of the City of Milwaukee is a modern testimony to the foresight and vision of FDR and is a proud sponsor of today's lunch and festivities. I would also like to thank Laura de Golier of Insurance Planning Services in Fond du Lac, the Avant Garden, Bartolotta's Catering, Peggy Ann, Andy Vaughn, and Shannon Corallo for their financial contributions that made this event possible. And now I'd like to uh, bring up County Executive Scott Walker, who has some words to share with us. Uh, Scott? <laughs> Good morning. Uh, when I heard the bugle as an Eagle Scout, it brought back some memories. But I got to tell you, on that tape, I think my, both of my boys who are teenagers are, are not Eagles yet, but they're Scouts. But I'd like to borrow that tape in the mornings because they're teenagers. <laughs> and it doesn't just take one time. It would take multiple times to get them up in the morning. So I would appreciate that. Uh, I, it's a pleasure to be here today. Uh, many of the leaders, including uh, Mayor Baird and others, uh, are out in Waukesha at GE uh, meeting with the Milwaukee Seven, part of a regional a group of political and business and civic leaders uh, working on the betterment of the seven counties here in southeastern Wisconsin. I stepped out for, of that for just a little bit because I wanted to come by uh, to thank all of our veterans of the CCC, particularly because you're here at, at uh, Burner Botanical within Whitnall Park. Uh, when I think about this, and I, I have a proclamation, I'm not going to read all that because you've got plenty of other exciting people to hear from, including our great parks director, Sue Black, who's here. But in addition to acknowledging today and declaring that all throughout Milwaukee County to be uh, Civilian Conservation Corps and Civil Works Administration Day in honor of the 75th anniversary, I just wanted to personally come by uh, and say thank you to our CCC veterans. Uh, thank you for all the work that you did for us uh, here in this community, particularly in, in all so many different areas, but particularly in the parks. You know, Shirley talked a little bit uh, about Whitnall, and obviously there's a great connection there, but whether it's Whitnall or Curry or Esterbrook, what it's the spectacular band shell that we just remodeled a few years ago at Washington Park and got help from places like Harley Davidson, which is appropriate because the Davidson brothers used to live down the way uh, on, on uh, just on the other side of what's now the freeway, which was once the zoo. Uh, whether it's looking at the uh, bridges uh, that we've just spent a lot of time in the last couple of years working with the DNR and the Department of Transportation and others through the help of Guy Smith, who helps us keep track of our trails and our bridges, making sure the work we do to, re to reinvigorate those remains intact with the spectacular work that CCC employees did over the years. There's just so many testaments of the hard work and dedication and the skill not just hard work, but the skill in, in the parks that were developed and the bridges and the paths and the other things that really are a lasting legacy of your work here in this community. So I want to say thank you. The other thing I want to say thank you for is because you're an inspiration. We've got young men and women here from the Milwaukee Community Service Corps. Uh, we've got great leaders from AmeriCorps who are we're, we're with us. Uh, we have a great crew in addition of folks who've helped us through MPS in the park system this past summer. You, the veterans of the CCC, are the inspiration for those young men and women, uh, not just to be engaged and involved in our community and in our parks, but really to do the kind of top-notch quality work that you did, in many cases, decades and decades ago, that is still with us today and an example of the great community that we live in. We say thank you for that legacy, and more importantly, thank you for that inspiration to the next group of people who will be building the legacy in the future. God bless you. Thank you, Scott. Thanks for taking time out of your busy schedule to uh, spend a little time with us. And since you like that bugle music so much, Michael, give us another one. <laughs> 